I'm Daily Fix and welcome to part 8 of our X4 Foundation series. So today I want to do a few things. Uh, let's go into map and because we're currently with the faction representative, we're going to be buying the spice uh, production module and I'm going to be setting up some of these ships to be on fill shortages and to make sure that goes the way I like them we're going to be setting up some restrictions the reason I would like to do some fill shortages is because it's a level 2 action and you can actually train your level 2 pilots to become a higher level by doing letting them do things that are higher the trade restrictions uh, I think we actually bought two new ships that are on their way right yeah here you go so these two ships, they will eventually go onto a uh, repeat order, which is a level one. And it will take a long time. So the morale will go up and eventually they will go into level two. And then we can set them up to be uh, fill shortages. And as a level three advanced auto trade. Now I am aware that we actually do have a pilot that is three and a half. This, this gorgeous fella. Level three and a half. And he's sitting on his ass as a, well, as a manager. His morale is quite low and I want to change that. Also, uh, getting a level three plus is quite nice early on. And I want to give him a large ship. Maybe like all for, for trade-in, maybe even mining. Probably not mining because, you know, um, the pests are quite annoying. But definitely a large ship because I don't want to lose him because, well, he made a wrong decision. Now, as for this guy, let's just get this out of the way. Oh, that's licenses, Good don't want that. To you. Yeah, great profit. Uh, blueprints, modules, production, and these prices go up quite a bit. I will never buy something for 20 million. I should actually have already made plans to start uh, work on on our player owned headquarters so we can get the station hacking done uh, we'll probably set that up today as well for now let's go for spice like i said it is the next it's a million though yeah you know what let's let's not it's it's expensive i hate that Good let's not profit yeah no not with those prizes we don't uh let's get to our ship now also this guy won't be selling the medical supplies. I'm actually very interested ah. in taking a look at... Hello. Yes, hi, go away. Um, at how expensive the medical supplies is going to be. I'm going to be thinking... And I could be wrong. Somewhere in the region of like 5 million. So while we slowly head out of space... Should be heading in. Let us take a quick look at these. I'm going to be waiting with these guys to when they're actually set up like waiting before we change pilots we are going to be changing pilots we have one guy on Taladi two guys on the patriarchy I want to start changing how we do this oh yes we do need repeat orders hopefully leveling up our pilots to be level two you know, having them on combat missions probably will go faster uh, than this. But you know what? We need to make money. We need to make cash. That's also important. So we'll wait with those. Uh, let's set our waypoint over here to the Ministry of Finance. Uh, let's take a look how the autopilot is going to reacting to this. Is he going to be flying us into the station? Is he? Oh, you are, aren't you? Oh, I have a bad feeling about that. No, actually, he's staring away from it. That's cool. Great. Uh, so we'll, we'll just go over there. We're waiting for these guys. You are... I think, Doc, no, you're changing equipment still. You are having difficulties. And so is this guy, apparently. Yeah, he is having difficulties. See, he's doing the weird thing. Oh, maybe that's me. Yeah, that's me. Never mind. Ah, he's done. Cool. 
let us take a quick look. Let's save for a second here. Uh, we're going to be looking for those captains with the exception of uh, these two fellas. Well, we could actually use him, but we do need a manager that's level 2 in the sunrise. Um... You're on solid distribution. You're actually a decent manager. Uh, I don't want to rotate too much. You know what? Let's just stick to the captains. You're in the patriarchy. You are a level 2. You will be working from now on. On the distribution mark 1. Accept that. And let's go to our map. Distribution mark 1. There should now be a crew member over here. You'll work in the patriarchy. Yeah, which one is it actually? Should have checked that. Uh, okay, so it is the 880. As a captain. It will take them a while to get there. And you can actually see whether or not they are there. Um... Uh, well, maybe not because this is only one guy. So the name usually is grayed out. So we'll go for this one. Uh, doesn't have more crew. Wait, why not? Did he not stock up on crew? Wait, 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 wait. I do have that set up right. Okay, for some reason they didn't. So let's do that. We need to grow our crew just as much. Uh, you are still... Not docked or you're in the process of. We also want to change him. We're waiting until he's absolutely down. We cannot transfer this guy when he is doing the uh, equipment change. Okay, did we actually make it to the station yet? No, we did not. That's fine. Yeah, the mob, I don't want to spend a million on this. Let's go to our POS, guys. Uh, and we're going to be setting up the build. Now, we don't have medium storage. And medium would have been ideal because it's absolutely cheap uh, to make those. But I don't have those yet. So we'll go with two cross connections, both on each side. And container one. Container 2. It's really far away. Flip you around. Doesn't have to be perfect. And then we'll just do... Copy. And there we go. We got four of those. Uh, the one thing I don't like... Is actually, the me you know... It's not very ideal. Like this. System. You don't like want your promise. medium ships to have to fly through this. Uh, but eventually we'll just get rid of this. Uh, we'll build it up completely. There's a lot of other points where we can do so. We'll actually save all resources because these are quite expensive. Anyways, let's continue that. Confirm. Let's assign a builder. Zoom out a bit. Uh, that one's busy. Uh, let's go with the Antigon. I think it's closest. And the goods. Yeah, it's expensive. Like mo almost a million as well. And now let's go into production. Is this will... To gain blueprints by scanning leaks on certain modules? I am aware of that, thank you. But I do appreciate you telling me. So this might be expensive. We need some graphene. We need some smart chips. Energy cell electronics. Let's start the research. Please gather the required materials. Yeah, yeah. I know you want me to do that. But I'm, I'm not going to do that. Uh, also, it seems that our... We're just flying now. For no particular reason to absolutely nowhere. Engaged. Okay. How are you guys doing? Are you there? Yeah, your name is now in color. This is the wrong guy. Where did I send that guy to? Interesting. Pilot level 1. Why would I want you over there? Oh, I think we need to set him up. Yeah, that's what... That was it. Yeah, okay. It's fine. We'll, we'll, we'll be able to do this. Uh, let me get another pilot over here. 
Uh, Captain... Uh, Kestrel. There you go. You, my man. You're going to be working somewhere else. You're going to be working on this as a captain. Let's assign you over there. And we will tell... This person... Work Entering somewhere else. System. And you're going to be working on the Kestrel because they were busy getting more satellites. Yeah, I've actually set up some orders to do that. He's been busy. Uh, he's been doing good. It seems like I'm going to be missing another ship in a second because he is getting his ass kicked. Ah, oh, that is so annoying. I hate these guys. We That's why we need protection ships. He will be gone. There's no... We can't save him. See, yeah, no way. Where's the... What are you guys doing? Ah, you absolute Auto donkeys. Disengage. That is annoying. That is so annoying. Oh, well. It is what it is. Let's take a look. Are you there? Did you... What are you trying to do, mate? Okay, it seems we might need to remove order and assignment. And do it again. Upgrade and repair. Free service crew member. Add that to shopping list. And you actually have the same issue. Upgrade and repair. Get free of those. Right, he is done. Okay, great. Let's uh, let's go set up a few things. And we're going to be going mainly into the individual instructions. Now, you can't set up regular trade routes and stuff like that. If you want to do the fill, uh, fill shortages, we're going to... We're mainly going to go in, in the blacklist of things that we want them to do. One of them is well, i'll go over these sec so sector travel is you don't want any of your ships flying through a sector and that mainly usually are civilian ships that are owned by enemies because well they're quite defenseless we have actually seen what can happen with a medium ship uh, that's why i like to use my mining ships like uh, large ships they have enough defenses on them to survive for quite a bit so we'll set these up as a um, anti anti hostile anti hostile uh, travel. So save that. Uh, the next one we're going to be is sector activities. So you can usually use these on mining ships that you don't want to have have. You don't want to mine in certain systems or warring stuff as well. You probably don't need both as a travel. Because if you can't travel to a hostile environment, there's also yeah no reason to do activities in there. But I like to set them up regardless. Owned by enemies, anti-hostile. And this is going to be called activities then. Just so... To make it easy let's save it and there's another one and they will have going to have multiple of these and that's actually trade restrictions so the way i want to set some of these shortages fill shortage up is the following i want them to go to either the argon federation and stay in those sectors like you, you will be trading with the Fed, uh, Argon Federation assisting those building up that relationship instead of just going them all over the galaxy don't want that um, eventually I want to include the Antigon with the Argon Federation although it's not really that they're, they're both actual factions it's not like with the Ministry of Finance uh, with the Teladi company, which we'll also be setting up. But the Argon Federation, so this is going to be uh, Argon only. Save blacklist. Um, the next is going to be... Actually, I want to rename that. This is a trade restriction. So Argon... Argon... Uh, trade only 
Uh, I know it, you don't have to. I like to do these things because, well, uh, oh, I canceled that. I'm such an idiot. Organ caps off. Great. Only confirm changes. And the next is going to be a lot. I actually don't do it like this. Don't do it like that. Because it will actually go over the other one. Create a new one. Deladi trade only. Restrict factions. And this is going to be the Ministry of Finance and the Deladi company. And I will not have them trade with my. We can also set that up for the... For the Patriarchy, actually. Might as well just... Uh, no, because they need to be level 2. Don't want to restrict trade on a level 1 by accident. So we'll just leave it like this. We have two pilots. Two actual pilots of level 2 that will be on the restrict. So this is going to be fill shortages. And for the Argon Federation... It's going to be refined metals. The R, oh, oh, where are you? Uh, I'm always blind. Refined metals as well as, I think it's silicon. Silicon wafers. Yeah, I think the carbine is for the, the Terrans. So, because we've set up the satellites with the refined and the silicon, uh, we can do it like this. Now, because this does not change anything for that pilot. We're going to go into... Uh, yes, I do want to confirm that. I, uh, I, I'm really... like I have not been able to do this for a few days. And you can actually tell right away. Uh, refined metals. Wafers metals. Confirm. Stop him from doing that because he can go anywhere now we're going to be changing the name uh like we did over here but this is going to be different uh we're going to be doing this as a fs because he's filling shortages our argon so we know this is the one going to the argon federation okay uh Hit enter, so that name did actually change. Go into behavior. Now you can see the anti-hostile traveling and the anti-hostile activities with a capital C apparently. Uh, but now we have trade restrictions. So in this we can say, hey, I want you to do the Argon trade only, please. You have to set it up manually. You don't want all of your ships being on Argon only by accident. The other trade rule that we have been using for say the tier 1 and the tier 2 is only for stations unfortunately and yeah it's quite annoying oh well it is what it is so now we can unpause this he will go to the Argon Federation it might take him a bit of time to find trade but we did up we did set up satellites those are quite mandatory in my opinion so he does have always the right the, how do you say it? the updated orders that's what we need he needs updated orders because otherwise he will tr travel to a point and he comes in range updating those travel orders and he's like oh wait that's actually not uh cheap so he will go search for a new one it actually takes him i think it's like 30 seconds every time or well, 30 seconds to a minute it used to be uh for the other guy did you get your crew now by any chance? You did. Let's uh, we'll set up those restrictions first. So you're going to be Taladi only. And if that works, we could maybe just have the Taladi guy do something completely different. Maybe going as a secondary Argon Federation one. And once those other guys level up, having two ships go in either sector would actually be great building up relations. You are going to be uh, fill shortages. Uh, Teladi. Enter that. Name changed. And fill shortages. Teladium. Uh, because Teladi doesn't work with refined metals. With a T, Teladium. And silicon wafers. Confirm that. And yeah, hopefully they will start doing things. It might take them a while though. 
Definitely. So you can start building up fleets like this. If this guy does his trade and you assign another ship to him, it might take a while. But when this guy uh, starts a trade, he goes to a station and buys something that will trigger the second ship to start doing so as well. We can also assign um, small ships to the fleet to protect those guys. I believe that actually works like that. So yeah, that, that's future stuff that I do want to start moving into. So these eventually will be fleets. Delali, Argon, most likely uh, Patriarchy. And we'll just see how those uh, things eventually go. I do want to see them actually uh, getting started. Hopefully soon they will start doing stuff. But you know, we'll just leave it for now. We are outside of the station for quite a while. Let's fly in. And I want to see the cost of the medical supplies for the Tladi. So each faction has a different way. I'm actually considering that might be one of those ships starting to do stuff. Is that true? Absolutely not. Well, that's, uh, that's a bit of a bummer. Oh, well, let's go. And then we're going into a tiny bit of exploration again. I do want to improve relations with the patriarchy quite a bit, actually. Uh, let's get up. Welcome. Welcome. Why did I keep double saying welcome? Uh, represent. Yeah, so this guy should actually have the medical supplies. Uh, blueprint and if he doesn't then 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 I don't know uh, blueprint modules production and yeah medical supplies 1.6 million actually it's not that bad and we can actually buy so the others are grayed out as you can see so we do need to improve relations with the Ministry of Finance now <sighs> That will happen over time. Guys, you don't have to focus on that. So just trade with them. Make sure you have satellites uh, with their stations. That's all you need. Come uh, on, oh man. I want to see you guys move. Yeah, it might take a while. Oh, well, it's fine. Let's take a look. Kestrel is placing down some more satellites. We need to actually go here to skill plate base. I want to see if they have the materials for us to make space bomb. I also want to start mapping the entire highway. We haven't done so. Uh, we actually got a bit of the other faction over here. Not all of them. And I need to remember getting those other data vaults and doing some missions because we're actually quite close getting to plus 10 with the Argon Federation. We're at plus 8, so it's quite nice. And Patriarch is a negative 4, so it's, it's going there. Definitely going there. I also want to meet the Terrans and set up ships the way I've done so far. They've worked out for me. I quite like them. Because they just build up relation. You don't want to shy on relations now, do you? For us... Yeah, let's let's go over the skill plate base. I'll meet you up there because that's going to be a bit of a, a fly. Oh, I just... Um, coming back to show you that he actually found a trade. So he's currently going to the Argon Silicon Refinery. And then he is going to be buying silicon wafers. Now you can also just check because he should actually already take in the money. Yeah, 120,000. So it, it does work. It just takes a tiny bit of time. Uh, you can also see over here, this one's now orange. Uh, he has a problem finding places to buy. You can see that he will be switching. So we're going to be moving this to 260. And I'm going to be moving the other guy because he actually just bought them. Up to 280, 290, just to keep those 30, um, 30 cents per item profit at the bare minimum. So that will actually go, just, you need to babysit these every now and then. 
let's, well, let's take a quick look over here. How is this going? Yeah, okay. So we're falling short because we're starting to lose mining ships over here. Which is, well, somewhat problematic. I, I don't want to actually replace them. But there is, well, not much that we can do about that at the moment. One of the things, though, that we could do is actually go to Faulty Logic. Go to Faulty Logic and get that large ship. But a large ship is way too slow. So, tell me, how do you deal with your mining ships being arrested early in the game? Because you, you can't save all of them, right? So, yeah, looking forward to that. Do you invest in, like, a group of five fighters just to Entering send them to the ships that are in, uh, in having some issues? Like, does that work out for you or not? Oh, even the Taladi ship is now on its way. Very, very nice. Taladium factory, buying Taladium. And he did that for a 85,000. So we're keeping in tra we'll keep an eye on those. Seeing if they uh, do a good job. And I'll, uh, I'll still meet you up at the skill plate base. Hopefully we can buy some of those EMP stuff. Okay, so we actually managed to get that. There is a mission over here that we... Uh, should we do a mission like that? Uh, nah, not really. Uh, so I keep getting the message extend POS in... In my display um, that's currently Copy ongoing granted. so we're not have to look at it. so uh, I've been thinking about so setting up the other done. pilots as a sort of a fleet as well Welcome. not on dock let's get up we need to start investing in skill books that should not be too problematic going for level one and level two and this way we can always make sure that we uh, we do good. Let's go to the Trader's Corners first. There's no bar, I think. I actually didn't check. Is there a bar in here? Uh, no. That's fine. So let's talk to you. You don't really look like skill play, but that's fine. Uh, show me your wares. Uh, remote detonators. Uh, yes, please. Uh, lodestone. I'll take those. Uh, we don't have security containers, it seems. So that is, you know, a bit of a shame. Um, 22 will be enough for a very long time, though. What do we have over here? Piloting, basic seminar, as well as a level 1. So we'll take those. I don't care for the management. Security bypass. We'll, we'll look it into those like later. Not right now. Yeah, I don't see any containers. Well, that's fine. So that's still 300,000 credits uh, we're getting rid of. Uh, let's... I like actually like this system quite a bit. Look at that planet like that. That looks so nice. It's a shame it's skill played and eventually they, these bases will actually get destroyed. Um, so let's do it. This distribution ship is doing a trade very slowly, as you can see. Slowly getting that out. So I was thinking of doing the same thing with my... Oh no, what are you... Are you being attacked? No, okay, you're being scanned. That's fine. Wow. Uh, with the patriarchy as well. I'm going to be changing this because I cannot type patriarchy for the life of me. So I'll just keep them at Z -I, uh, Z -Y -A. So let us quickly set that up as well. And we'll change these to have the same thing. I like to use the brackets then. Firm. And with the Taladi. Firm. And the new one is going to be... So I don't have to use my brain to figure out how to type things. Uh, trade only... Restriction. And that is going to be actual the, the actual patriarchy right now. I, we can also set them up for the free families. That's quite a distance away. And uh, yeah, I, I don't want to do that right now. So this will actually be quite important because there is a lot 
of uh, xenon present in those systems. Let's disclude myself. Save that. And let's go set those guys up. Let's set them up for success. Uh, you are going to be buying. I kind of want to have a ship that already is full. Oh no. Oh no, it happened. Wait, did the Argon... Did the Argon Federation blow it up? They are at war with the Argon Federation though. Oh, that's bad. Yeah, this might be very short-lived. Now we can only do refined goods because I kind of didn't set up the silicon refinery stuff. So we have to start sending our Kestrel who is currently just on his ass over there. Doing absolutely nothing. Um, how much do you still have in your cargo hold in terms of satellites? A whopping five. Yeah, that's not going to be enough. Uh, let me quickly go around setting up these satellite placements as well as giving him the order to buy more and then we'll set up the actual fleets of these uh, two ventures to do whatever i kind of want them to do okay so there was only one station that did something with the silicon wafers uh we're still going ahead and setting up the the order even though this is going to be you know this is somewhat problematic uh, i don't like it that uh, this was blown up. It's... Yeah, it's this energy boa. No, the Patriarchy laser tower is actually shooting the behemoth over here. I think the behemoth blew up the station. I, I don't really know if that is the case. Still, I don't like it. So, let's go to these guys. Uh, are you filled up? No? How about you? Um, yeah, you are. So, pilot... You are currently... Could you actually do it? Alright, let's, let's pause it for a second. So we actually have some time to check it out. I'm going to be uh, removing all orders and assignment for you. Would you be able... Ooh. Come on, you dum-dum. You can find it. It's this guy, huh? Yeah, it's this guy. No, no fill shortages. Uh, let us contact him. And give him a seminar. And that should actually do its wonder. Fill shortages. Um, silicon wafers and refined metals. And we'll look into other goods uh, at the future as well. Let's confirm that for now. Uh, let's set up the trade restriction. You're going to be patriarch trade only. That's good. That should be it. So if we unpause, he should now have its new orders. Going around doing its thing, hopefully. Uh, let's change the name of this particular ship. Because this is going to be the leading man. And now we can just do bracket. Not like that. Bracket. Open, bracket, and close. Uh, fill shortages. Press that as enter, and that's done. We have the foundation of three of our, well, uh, three of our uh, fleets. Are you still going to go and buying them, or are you actually going to be selling? After planning trade, they are selling. Yeah, profit from trade order. We have to wait until he actually does the trade, so we see how much profit that they will make. Yeah, it's quite difficult to see it like this. Um, because also the money will go directly into my wallet. Uh, next up is you. I need to wait until he triggers and actually does, starts doing something. And then we can start adding ships to them. Uh, you will actually then follow the fleet. So the restrictions don't count for you. That is fine. However, everyone that we add to that fleet... Will have to be a level uh, 2 Sir. pilot. Otherwise he won't be able to do a thing. But this will make it easy to actually start adding ships. That will secure them. Uh, if I do ASP. I think I should be able to defend commander. 
So you will be commanding, uh, you're doing that, uh, or bombarding, you know, all of that stuff. Uh, just hopefully we can get rid of some of those scale plate ships. For now, let's head back to our ship. Ah, oh, actually, Greetings. it's already a lot of things can that we've I done. Help? Yeah, Goodbye. you can. You can definitely not put your head through my ceiling, please. Let's undock. Let us head out to Napoleon's Fortune, which is right over here. So we need to set course to this particular base. This is an asteroid field, so I'll be flying myself. And I'll, uh, I'll meet you guys there, because there's actually a lot of bases over there. And one of my favorite first systems to claim for my own empires as well. Because there is a very high abundance of ores and silicons. So always a good place to start, but you will need to have some defenders with you because of the hive uh, pests that we have infested in that particular system. Oh wow. Oh, he did good. Holy crap, he did good. He, uh, he bought, as you can see, 755 Taladium. And he, well, he definitely did great. Way to go, dude. That's a, that's a gorgeous purchase. Way to go. And I think that's a definite success. We need more of those uh, ships, actually. That will off-put this. Because our empire will be difficult. I might just move away from this. Uh, and then... Focus a bit more on the trade. This is the, you know, the unworthy entrepreneur start anyways. And I did tell you guys that we will be doing a lot of trading. Also, yeah, do let me know in the comment section what you want to see. I can show a lot more. And I do cut out quite a bit uh, of the traveling and stuff like that. Also doing missions and stuff. I've not shown you that I'm actually doing missions to improve relations. So yeah, let me know if that is... Uh, if you want me to turn this into more of an actual playthrough than me highlighting things, because that's basically what's going on right now. Highlighting things uh, that I think are interesting for you guys to watch. Entering system. Because Locally if we fortune. do... If we keep up the way we're doing it now, eventually... The, um, the, em the episodes are going to be either very short or uh, we just won't have a lot of episodes going. Because, you know, I'm not skipping millions of years and then, you know, uh, having a fleet and being at war and stuff like that. Let's go to that station over there because that is a Tikva. Uh, let's see if they actually have what we want to have over here. Let's, uh, let's get up. Uh, well, trade this corner. Uh, sometimes I'm hoping for just a bar. Because I'm lazy. I don't want to start doing the scanning stuff. Uh, secure containers. There we go. Two of them. That's great. Uh, Lodestone. Seminar for pilots. Definitely take that. Start taking these books everywhere I find them. We also need to go with a bomb launcher. But it's no point if we don't... If we haven't finished the POS and researched... There's no point in actually buying the bomb launcher. Uh, speaking of that... It seems that the hull parts are slowly going in. And there is still a bit more money than what is necessary. For now, let's just start making those EMP... And we actually, 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 there's a few things that we need. I kind of need the other ones more. I need the bombs. We need the unstable crystals. Because we have the Del Busta mission chain. Um, we could actually set ourselves up and start doing that. So we need unstable crystals, which we can just get ourselves by just shooting some a bunch of asteroids. Might as well just go ahead and do that, right? So we're quite near a sector that has a lot of those. Uh, it's on dock. I love the station though. I love the look. Um, and we'll go over here. I spend a lot of my time in this sector usually pirating. 
This sector is not owned by anyone because it's grayed out and the next one isn't either. But it is a huge, uh, a huge amount of ships. And I'll, I'll usually just start taking like these large ships. And I might be considering doing that if we could get ourselves uh, one of these. So one of these ships I usually use for boarding is for from the Argon Federation. That is the large ship and I think it is called... I think this one, uh, we need crew 225. I think that is quite... I think that's the large, yeah, 110. 225, 170. Yeah, definitely. This is the one that we need. So, uh, dumbass, this one. 225 marines. Now, the ship does cost a lot of money. And it's slow. Oh, it is slow. But, you know, if you just have marines on them and they launch from a system like this, like, you only have to stop the ship for a while for those marines to actually attach. Don't shoot them too often to, you know, avoid getting the negative penalty. And you'll start taking a lot, uh, a good amount of these large ships. Construction ships, I think, are one of the best ways of training uh, crew members before going into terraforming. Because then you'll get, like, that, uh, that station that uh, trains pilots to level... I think it's three or four. Question mark. But yeah, that, that's what we'll most... Uh, I think we want to do that. That means we have to start making sure our stations... Get a dog for large ships. Okay, let's uh, quickly see if we can get some unstable crystals. Um, scanning mode. And we're looking for these... Um, these dark spots actually on the asteroid. Usually if you're doing mining, you'll go after them. Asteroid. That's silicon. Wow, that's actually... Holy crap, they look at that yield. 25,000? <laughs> Woohoo! Asteroid. Uh, more... Takes a bit of time, but eventually you'll get uh, some unstable crystals as well. Or you just blow up the uh, asteroids. You know, if you're lazy, asteroid. like me, you'll just start shooting the asteroid until they get poof. Ah, here we go. Unstable crystals, six of them. Just shot them off that asteroid. There we go. We have enough to build ourselves... Three spacesuit bomb. What are you actually? Let's asteroid. take a quick look. You're just an asteroid. Okay, so let us quickly go over here. Uh, set guidance. So that's usually how I'll just go about. Start highlighting, the, just shooting those highlighted sections. And if you're really bored, to just start blasting away at those damn asteroids. You know, make them regret being an asteroid. How is this going? It seems that... Uh, 84, uh, 91, almost a grand, uh, almost 100,000, sorry, uh, uh, we should actually be okay. This one is filling up, this is the one that is actually doing, you know, very, very good. It's a healthy, healthy trader. And this guy is, let's uh, take a look, he... Entering I think this is a buy order. Six. You know, this is a sell order. Is that a sell order? If that is a sell order, I'm not sure if I'm liking that. Yeah, this is still on the uh, on the other one. Selling, selling. Maybe it's not the full cargo. Eight hundred and sixty-two, six hundred and seventy. How much did he buy then? Uh, he did buy 862. That's yeah, not the not a huge profit, but Auto you know, this is the start of a fleet, guys. Like I said, this is the start of a fleet. Uh, did I level up one of these guys already? I think I'll start with the Taladi fella over here. To be fair, 
uh, what are you doing? You are currently going to be buying. Yeah, we're not going to do that anymore. Uh, remove orders and assignments. We'll be leveling you up. So, contacting you. Can I help? Give a seminar. Leveling one. Say over goodbye. And out. Over and out. How can you say out when it's over? That should be enough, hopefully. Uh, we can check. It's not. Oh, I hate when that happens. Uh, we need to replace the captain on this one. That is so annoying. Sunrise, you are that manager. I'm going to keep you as a manager. I'm sorry. Asp. Yeah. This one is clearly a level 2. Taladi distribution. Taladi vulture distribution 1. I think that is... is this, isn't this the guy that we were just talking to? Where isn't that? Yeah, look at that. This is what I'm talking about. How, see how important morale is? Like, the guy is good, but the morale is absolutely crap. Any of you guys? Um, no. No. <laughs> Hell no. Oh, darn, I hate that. That is so obnoxious. Like, the morale is absolutely ruining our plan over here. I'm still going to assign him to the Taladi one. So, you're going to be mimicking commander behavior set as to alpha. Uh, hopefully, in time, the morale of this guy will improve. And he will start doing his thing. So, we have our first fleet. Uh, let us uh, rename the fleet. Into the Taladi fill shortage fleet. Confirm that. So, first fleet, uh, one of many. <laughs> many, I hope. Um, so, we have a plan for next part. Then. Next part order. is e. we will be getting Del Basta, I Docking think. Granted. I might as well just go for it. Where's the docking port over here? I can see going up. Okay. At least we had something like decent done. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm sure some of you love it if I pick up the pace. Successfully docked. And I know I talk a lot. I know I talk a lot. I'm sorry. Um, Welcome. I just enjoy playing the game. Sorry for that. I'm sorry. <laughs> Uh, let's get those bombs ready. We do need to invest in this in the in the in the in the bomb suit launcher. I think we need two of them. But I'm not sure. So we'll craft actually we can only do two, that's fine. So hopefully that is going to be enough. Let's go talk to can you. What's your you wares? Go. Got some more lodestone. We have three of them. That's fine. Basic piloting, yeah, it's not too interesting actually. Don't need that. Yeah, let's get the bomb launcher. Let's get the spacesuit thrusters mark two. Still a lot of money, but then again, Good profit to you. We earned it. We earned it. And with that, I'm going to be leaving you guys um, for this particular episode uh, to go over things. We did do the fill orders, uh, the fill shortage orders. They work. We started our own fleet. We didn't build a station and I am desperate to hear from you if you want me to turn this into more of a regular playthrough with more of the sightseeing included or if you want to continue or you want me to continue cutting out parts of me traveling etc etc. Um, let me know in the comment section and I'll see you next time. Have a good one. Bye bye.